Yes. <laughs> Jordan. <laughs> Jordan. Yes. She's correct, actually. Oh. <laughs> Hello, my name is Arwin Priscillus, and we're going to talk about Mamala today. The word back in ancient Chamorro times was a phrase used to refrain from bringing shame to the family. Oi, manunga na oma mamala. Nowadays, it means shy. Par, eat your food. Quit being mamala. So we interviewed several UG students about the phrase. Will they know the original meaning or will they know the meaning that's held today? Or do they even know the meaning at all? Let's find out. Do you guys know the phrase mamala? Oh, yeah. Or like... Kind of. I've heard it. I don't know exact yes. meaning, but I've heard it before. Yes, I do. Yeah. No. No. I don't know, it sounds like a type of food, I think. Uh, I've heard of it like once or twice, but um, I, I think I have a gist of the word mamala. Not sure. No. Do you want to guess what it is? Mamala. It's a more word for like, uh, maybe a family member. Are, are you very sure about that? No. <laughs> what does the phrase mean? I think it means, don't be ashamed. If so, what does the phrase mean? Um. Like shameless? Mama. Wait, no, 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 no. My grandma called me Mama. Shame, what, shame. what was I doing? Shameless. <laughs> it's one. Of, it deals with shame. Mm -hmm. Just the word shy. Okay. It means being shy. It's like shy or embarrassed to like do something. Is it like about respect for or something? How would you use the phrase? Don't be so Mama Lao. Hmm. I mean, like people use it like, oh, you're being so Mama Lao or something like that. Like going to someone's house that you don't know, like your friend just invited you and asking you to eat would be mamala. Okay. How would I use a phrase? Oh um, uh, man, for I guess if someone was to grab food and he didn't want, that's when I would say, "Why you being mamala?" I guess. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like. I know. You, why are you so ashamed to go up there? Like, why are you so mamala to go to it's the like table? It's like a good shame, though, kind of right? Thing. Like. Yes. <laughs> like get Just over kidding, yourself and <laughs> like don't be mamala to go to the table and eat. It means like, because I remember this one time it was a rosary and then I wanted to eat but then my grandma's like saying stop being mamala and I was like, I know but I'm hungry, so I did go up. So I think mamala what she said is like shame, okay. kind of thing. Good shame though. I think it's good shame. Good shame. Do you think it began like that? Like that was the first meaning of it? Maybe it changed over time, I guess, the meaning of it. Yeah, so what do you think the original meaning was? I think something about being respectful or something. I've, I think. Yeah, do you agree with him? I, I feel that Mamala is, could be used. I, I mean, it has changed over time, but I feel like it's, a, it's more of a negative to, like way. Like you're being Mamala, I feel like maybe in the ancient times it was like you're naughty or shy or I don't know. I don't know, like it means many things, but I guess in ancient times, um, it could be used as uh, you're being naughty, I guess. Do you think that the original meaning of this word was like the same as it is now to back then, to like ancient Chamorros? No, I don't think so. I don't. I really don't know the origins of Chamorros, <laughs> so I wouldn't know. By the way, how they use it, I still think it would mean ashamed or shy. Oh, the ancient Chamorro? Oh. No. Good no. shame. Yes. No, it like, no, he's saying ancient Chamorro meaning. Yes. No. Yes. <laughs>